It's the first time they've um, invited the Philippines to this very prestigious congress. And at the same time, it was very, very intimidating and nerve-wracking because all the people that go to this congress are like the best of the best. I was very excited to just show to the world what Filipino food can be, how we eat, our way of life. It was great and inspiring listening to all these nice people. They all just supported each other because there was a bigger picture and it wasn't about themselves. It was about their cuisine and that's why their Spanish cuisine is thriving because they're all cooperative with each other. Because as the saying goes, it takes a village, right? And I can't do it alone. I need help. So if it's a presentation, you're just not cooking. You're presenting, you're feeding, and of course, it has to look nice as well. Because I can't do things by myself. I need help. I always need that support team. My theme was Negrensic cuisine, so I chose Inasal, being from Bacolod and being like that main, one of the main dishes in my province. So Inasal, and then the other one is Binacol, which is a protein or meat cooked in coconut water. The one speaker that really moved me uh, was Chef Carme, the first female Spanish chef to get a three Michelin. Now she has a total of seven. She said, Generosity can be in different forms, even in competition. And I think that was amazing. And uh, for all the greats paying tribute to her was just moving. It just made me realize that we have a very long way to go, but it's doable. We just gotta take baby steps. I wanna cook for the world. 